Hi everyone, what's up? Well, as you know, I uploaded a couple of videos yesterday, one of them being the tutorial on how to tell if your uh, tarantula is in pre molt or not. Well, that was made a couple of days ago. I think it was made on Sunday. Now it's Valentine's Day. Love is in the air. And guess what? The Lassidora Fracta just molted right now. And I'm kind of disappointed because I wanted to catch it on film. Now it's like 10 a.m. Right over here, 10.02 a.m. And yeah, it molted. And I believe he might have molted last night while I was sleeping. Uh, anyway, it's my last day of school before I start my student teaching. So definitely this L Fracta has grown considerably large now. Um, definitely probably around the three inch mark. He's not three and a half yet. So, Amanda, when I first originally bought this El Fracta, it's in the same deli container, although now it's going to get a rehouse. Uh, probably a two liter shoebox enclosure. They marked it as a female question mark, so let's go see if that's the truth. I really don't want you to do that. There we go. Yeah, those Laxadoras are famous hair kickers. <clears throat> Maybe during the expo I'll uh, see if I can get a Laxadora Idubunai, which is another Laxadora that looks exactly the same as your Parahibana. Okay, so this is, this is a great molt. It's intact, and luckily I caught it just in time. So here's a molt and what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up the admin area like I always do and that's usually what you should check to see if your T is a male or female. So like I said in the other video if it's a female you should see the flap And if it's a male, you should not see the flap. Okay, now this one I'm going to have a little hard time sexing, because it is a little bit on the small side. Um, maybe not. To me it looks like a female. Here we go. Let's uh, have a look at the specimen up close and personal. So I'm going to show you exactly where to find this epigastric, uh, the spermatheci, which is the sperm sac, which uh, which is where mature males uh, eject their sperm into the female. So I'm making out this little flap. It's really hard to see because it's still a little bit too young. But I think I do see it right over here. And my Nandu tripepi did not have it, so this could be actually the truth. Nice. It's too bad my El Clue is a male, but I got to enjoy him. Alright, perfect. Yeah, so that looks like a female to me, I would say. Awesome. So, hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and stay tuned for uh, more videos to come. I'll be starting to make some, and then after, uh, videos won't be coming in as often, because I'm going to be starting my stash very soon, and that's five days a week, so the only time I will have to time to make videos is probably late at dark, or towards the weekends. Oh well, c'est la vie. Alright, enjoy everyone. Thanks for watching.